It is never easy. When you hear that somebody like that you expect to be here every day. Is suddenly not. So it's, it's, sorry. <laughs> Bring it in. Oh. <laughs> Charles Abel Lear joined KCRA seven years ago and was KCRA's Assistant Creative Services Director, a wildly talented husband, son, and co-worker who roared literally through life. He loved that motorcycle, so it was 90 degrees outside, full leather. Some days he'd have on his button-down shirt and he'd still have on his leather chaps. Charles, or Charlie, as a lot of us called him, brought a sense of wonder to work as he guided our station image on TV and online. He had an uncanny, or if you played Greg Brady on The Brady Bunch and spent a day on a shoot with Charlie, frightening encyclopedic appreciation for classic TV. I am the glue that holds this family together. He was like a savant at digital animation and graphics. He would spend hours, even days on effects that you could blink and miss. And he animated this rooster that's like right at the very beginning of the promo. The roosters aren't even awake yet. And um, we got a little bit of flack for it, for you know, it being like cartoony, but it was so well done. Who builds a rooster? <laughs> Charles does. <laughs> Charles did. Well, Charlie's job was to make us look good. Charlie's catching a wave here in creative services. His calling was to make us feel good. I've told everybody that Charlie's Tigger in the office. He's the station cheerleader. He's always everybody's personal hype person. He was always in your moment. In your moment, in an era when it's borderline fashionable to be negative. He was always so positive. Just always a burst of just positive energy wherever he went. It was like so helpful. It was almost sometimes like it wasn't sincere. It can't be. You know what I mean? No one can be that positive. No one but Charlie. I would go to Charlie when I was having a bad day. We all go to those people. The thing is... It's funny that it's certain people that you don't realize that you're taking for granted. <sighs> That's gonna be the hardest thing. Until it's too late to tell them that what they bring to the table of life feeds your soul. For me, Charlie was a, a boost of energy that I so needed in my life. I think for me, the, the biggest lesson I've learned is it's not so hard to make the world a better place if you just try. Just a little bit. And Charles tried a lot. Be a Charlie, yeah, in your actions and day to day.